We're gonna go ahead and Mega Knight. We're gonna go ahead and Snowball that. We're gonna go ahead and get this down with arrows. And we're gonna give the good game. Alright, sweet. Woo! I got a little close there. I will take that. Alright, first dub. What's going on, y'all? Welcome back. Hope you guys doing well. As always, your boys back with another Clash Royale video, guys. Today's a very special day in the world of Clash Royale. Clan Wars 2.0 is live. The UI looks amazing, and there's a lot of great things that they added. Not not to mention all that free stuff that you guys get. I mean, that was I don't know. That was a awesome touch. I was not expecting that. Legendary King Chess at the most. But anyways, we're gonna go ahead and jump right in. You build your four war decks here, of course, and um, you can you can test them out, you know, from a PvE perspective and things like that. And I can tell you right now, guys, I build great defenses because I keep beating myself uh, when I test out my decks. But anyways, we're gonna go ahead and jump in. We're gonna go to straight 1v1. We're gonna go ahead and go with the P.E.K.K.A. Bridge Bam and see if we can't get a dub here. First ever war battle let's go we're gonna go ahead and give this here oh peck a bridge bam see what we got let's see what we got here i'm gonna go ahead and log that and we're gonna get this down here i don't want to show pekka yet and we're gonna go ahead and go in he's running i guess 2.6 let's see no he's not running 2.6 okay all right so should be able to get one hit. All right, we'll take that. Um, so I probably could have run Big Mama Pekka, but that Big Mama Pekka would have got shut down pretty hard there. So we're going to log this back. We'll get the E-Wiz down as well. Be able to clean up that Musketeer. All right, so he's definitely keeping up some good pressure. i got to try, try my best here to get... Uh, to double and to kind of match up here. I do want to activate King. Oh, man, come on now. Isn't that the right tile? All right, anyways, guys. Okay. <laughs> well played. All right. We got this, guys. We got this. All righty, all righty. So we got guards going on here. He's going to have his hog rider coming, I'm assuming. But I think what we're going to do is we're going to pressure this side, and we're going to make him use the Tesla. And then, I'm assuming, yeah, there we go. Okay, so, let's get this down. Just going to be real patient here. We're going to get the Big Mama Pekka down now. Hog still does get a hit. He did use his Tesla. We're going to go in with this here. The hopes we can dash. That's what I needed, one dash. Big Mama Pekka should be able to get in there, hopefully. All right, so that should be... Close-ish to tower, as in tower. So with the, um, so this kind of stink, does stink a little bit. Hog Rider's definitely going to be able to get some damage. Haven't even had to use, um, my poison yet. So let's go in with this. We'll see if he uses Tesla. Gonna go ahead and poison. Alright, and just need to save... Big Mama Pekka for his Hog Rider, which there it is. We're going to go ahead and log this back as well. And no hits, thankfully. We're going to go ahead and take this out. And we'll go in with the Bandit. We're going with this. We're going to have to poison this, I guess. Very close. All right, that was closer than I wanted to be. First war battle, though. We'll definitely take that dub. Probably could have played that a little bit better. I think the hog right at the beginning uh, with uh, the Big Mama Pekka. But, hey, I'll take that. <laughs> okay, now I get this. All right, we're already we're already into this Clash Royale. I appreciate that, though. Uh, it does feel really good. And, guys, I maxed out my graveyard. And I have, I think, two more L Jacks. And this account is max, ladies and gentlemen. Only took four years. Over four years now at this point. All right, so... All right, he says oh, this is weird, right? I get, you know, I don't know, man. It's it's refreshing. I'm very very excited about this. Very happy. So now that I've used that, so it's on a 15 hour cooldown, as you guys can see. So, um, so I have a hog rider deck here. 
uh, as well. I can just go right through the UI here. So I have a Hog Rider deck I'm going to be using. Pretty comfortable with this deck. Sorry, guys. Dirty Eagle. Um, and then the 3.1 um, Royal Gi Giant Cycle. You know, E-Wiz. There's an E-Wiz version, you know, whatever. There's a couple of different versions, actually. So we'll kind of um, run with that there. So, uh, but yeah, I got the first dub there. It looks like I'll be able to go into... Let's just spectate this, actually. Um, see how we're doing here. And also, too, when you when the shield is down, then that's when... And I'm making a strong assumption here. When the shield is down, which is like 12 hours from now, 11, whatever, that's when you can kind of attack the clan boats, the other clan boats, and then you have to repair them and things like that. So as a reminder, you guys want to probably use uh, your lower um, uh, clan members. What am I trying to say here? The lower clan members to to do that part of the um, the battle to help out. I guess you don't have to, but obviously when you're playing 1v1s and um, the duel and things like that, you know, it's going to be basically a lot of max level players, my assumption is, especially if you're in a um, legendary arena, so. Man, I don't know, it's very refreshing. I'll tell you what, too, guys, like, when I was testing out the um, PvE part, um, I was definitely starting to feel it. I'm not going to lie. Like, I was a little, you know, on the fence with the whole PvE, you know, part, but I think it's going to be a cool addition. I think they're going to need to add more of it because um, that's not maybe war-centered because the whole, like, cooldown piece, right, you kind of do your three, four, whatever battles there are, then you're sort of done. So, I don't know. It's going to be interesting to see how it all plays out, but to me, they probably need to add more of that kind of stuff. All right, this battle here is looking a little tough. It's going to be a little difficult, I think, to break through with the RG, with that Tesla. Um, and no real spell outside of the, the log. You got a lot of spam going on, though. All right, we're... Okay, I stand corrected with that, man. That might have been the most spirit goblins I've ever seen. Okay, so hopefully we can come back here. I'm kind of glad I didn't use my hog deck, and I won with that Pekka Bridge Bam. Pekka Bridge Bam is obviously still very strong. But it, you know, you got to be patient with it, right? And sometimes you can get down a little bit early on, but once double hits, you should be able to take the take the match. So, all right, we're starting spell cycle. Almost a great log there, almost. And this, of course, is the. Um, I think this was the mode of uh, the duel, so if you win two, you're good. That Royal Giant's going to clean up. Alright, that's GG's for sure. Well played. Well played. Now we won both of them too, so there you go, guys. That's how that looks. Sweet. Beautiful. Well done, Polly. Alright, so he got them all in there. That's great. Um, so I just want to kind of go in. Obviously, I can do other battles and such. Just going to donate here. Um, the UI, I love the UI. I love the transparent background and things like that as well. So I just wanted to kind of see where we're at here. Okay, so, all right, there's the fame. And we can see the other the other clan boats that are in here as well. All right, I think we've been doing pretty, pretty awesome there so far. Sweet, okay. All right, so let's see. The next deck here could be the... Hog Rider, and this is going to be the best of two, of course. All right, so let's just, let's go ahead and we're going to jump in with this. See, the thing is, is the next one, I guess I can just use RG Cycle. I'll start with the Hog Rider, um, but yeah, let's go ahead and let's jump in. We're going to go in with the Hog Rider deck here. Hope we don't face Golem. I had Inferno Dragon in there at first, but, uh, wait, what? Oh, choose your deck. Okay, you can do it from right here. Okay, we're going to go Hog Rider. Interesting. I thought I did that the initial part there, but I guess not. All right, so just no golem, please. All right, we'll get the, the furnace down. All right, we have a dark prince. I think we're going to go ahead and run the same here. And unfortunately, I'm going to lose my furnace. Oh, nope, not yet. Okay, so let's see what we got. All right, so what I'm going to have to do here is we're going to snowball, and then we're going to mega knight right now and hopefully be able to clean a lot of that stuff up we'll get this down as well the mega knight 
sorry, the Mega Minion will clean up the Mega Knight. So a lot of that's just going to die. All right, so we cancel out a little bit. He was a little late on that, but the Miner's definitely going to get some chip there. All right, so I got to be able to play my Hog Rider. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go ahead. If he gives me a minute there, if I get Max Elixir, I'm definitely going to go ahead and push opposite lane. He's, he is going to defend this, though, so that does make it a little bit hard. But I'm not, well, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and get this down. Use the shield. We'll be able to clean that up, though. All right, so I'm definitely, he used one of his counters, at least for the Hog Rider. So I'm definitely going to go ahead and run this. So he's running Giant Double Prince. I'm going to let that happen as well. All right, so we're going to get this down. He's going to have his miner, so i got to be a little careful. We'll see what he decides to do here, though. Um, we're going to get this down. Oh, that was well played there. Um, I'm going to go ahead and get this down. The giant's going to do a little bit of work for him. I'm going to go ahead and snowball. And we're going to go in here. definitely have to bring this over we're gonna get this down as well we're gonna pull this over and try to clean some things up if we can we got to get that mega minion out I'm gonna go ahead and run hog rider here definitely got to take this out Hope we can get two hits there. We're gonna get this down. All right, so the main thing we gotta watch out for here is we're gonna go ahead and Mega Knight. We're gonna go ahead and Snowball that. We're gonna go ahead and get this down with arrows. And we're going to give the good game. All right, sweet. Woo, I got a little close there. I will take that. All right, first dub. So we got to go with the next one here. So, man, guys, do I end with the dirty deck? I'm going to do it. <laughs> I'm going to do it. Um, I want to save my RG for the 1v1. I think that's what I still had left, right? I don't, I don't remember now. Okay, anyways. All right. So let's go in with this. We're going to go with the Barb Hut. All right, so we should be okay here, I think. Um, I'm hoping. I didn't really want to start with the bar putt, but we're going to go ahead and start to build this push-up, I think. Um, this is so dirty, man. All right, so he's got the poison. That kind of stinks a little bit. We're going to try to get this down here. Um... So the eagle um dies, but we're gonna go in, I think. Here, I'm going a little heavy. And I kinda wanna NATO everything to the tower. And hope that all stays healed. Alright, so hopefully the um Alright, I definitely have to play patient here. Um I gotta play the Electro Dragon. We have to try to reset here if we can. Alright, I was about to say that E Drag was in range there, guys. I think I'm gonna go ahead and hold off on the Barb Hut. Um, I wanted to play the Heal Spirit variation, but at the same time, you can only use the card once, so I went ahead, it, I went ahead and put that to the RG deck. Alright, so he's gonna push that lane. Um, I think I'm gonna go ahead and play opposite lane. And what I'm going to do is use the Barbarian Hut for that side. So we'll go ahead and get that down now over here. All right, so that, okay, all right, okay. So we've got to hope the Baby Dragon can clean up here for me. It's going to be difficult, actually. Um, well played on his part with the graveyard. Really well played. So I probably should have just went ahead and went in on the other side. All right, so we got to push real hard this side. It's all I can do. We're gonna go in with the E-Golem. We're gonna go in with this. Should be able to clean a lot of that up. 
We're going to go ahead and NATO a lot of this back this way. We're going to rage it up. I have no choice. I got to do it. Got to try to get in there if we can. All right, we're going to go in on this side as well because that tower gets cleaned up. We're going to go in. And we're going to go ahead and NATO everything to the tower. And I'm going to rage this up here. We're going to keep going. We're going to give this one right here and peace out. <laughs> All right. I'm not going to lie, though. I felt dirty. I felt dirty, guys. I felt dirty, but I had to do it. I wanted to save the RG deck. All right, but there you go, guys. Won my first three battles there. Guys, I'm not going to lie, man. I'm feeling, feeling pretty good. This is a new, fresh update. Very, very excited. I hope you guys are, too, as well. Um, so yeah, there'll probably be a lot more live streaming on my channel and things like that. So if you guys aren't currently subscribed, please consider doing so. Uh, but yeah, until the next video, I might bring a, a ladder one tonight, uh, definitely by tomorrow. We'll be, be doing a lot of just, you know, analyzing the game here from a Clan Wars 2 perspective, perspective etc. So anyways, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Until the next one, have a good one and peace out.